Michael, yes. we have some tricky questions for you. <laughs> you played in different clubs. Uh, what was your experience with, with the fans? I had always the pleasure to play for big clubs or clubs to actually where football was really important. And I think that's important for a player to feel the support of the fans, you know, when you come to the stadium, especially in difficult times, you know. Very early in my stage I played for Leverkusen. I moved to Bayern Munich, one of the rivals, you know. Yeah. The fans normally they don't really like it when a really good player left the club. But, but they you. took it well. Mostly 90% yeah. they, they understand and that was kind of why also I took the decision to go back at the end of my career at Leverkusen because I had such a great experience there. We have a little surprise for you. Okay. Ready? There are a few years in between. <laughs> When is this? It was 2002 and the other one was, uh, might be the last, last year, 2012. So 10 years. In between. Between, yeah. You look the same. I, I look the no? same. Uh, <laughs> I <laughs> realized that. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Michael, we have a few more questions for you. Lily, can I have the cards, please? Thank you. What is the song the fans used to sing for you? I think there was just this song, there's just one Michael Balak, one Michael oh, okay. Balak. It's only one. There's only one. But they copied <laughs> later, maybe with another player when I left. <laughs> Who is the best and the worst person in the plane or in the car? At Chelsea there was uh, Carlo Cudicini. He was always on the phone and he was very loud. The Italian loved to speak, really emotional all the time. What is your favorite sports movie? It's not a football movie, but an American football movie, any given Sunday. Okay. You see the dressing room, you yeah. know, which is really interesting for outsiders, for yeah. fans, but also for me as someone who knows what's going on in the dressing room in yeah. football. Al Pacino played a great role as a coach and had this Amazing speeches, which causes sometimes goosebumps, yeah, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can you do impression about uh, Al Pacino? <laughs> impression. <laughs> <laughs> Who will win the Europa League? From the papers, of course, Chelsea is one of the favorites. I hope uh, after the disappointment of the last year with the German teams, this year will be will be much better. Michael, it was a pleasure having this little chat with you. Hopefully next time we talk together, you'll have worked on your Al Pacino impression. <laughs> Hope so. <laughs>